Hello friends, the question is like this that we have to evaluate this integral 1 upon x square plus 1 into x square plus 4 with respect to x. Okay, now on observing the function uh, which we have to integrate we see that uh, it is a product of two quadratic expression x square plus 1 into x square plus 4. So this question can only be solved if we resolve this fraction into its partial fraction and after doing that it will become a very easy problem. Okay, so to resolve it into the partial fraction we take the given fraction and we write this as equal to ax plus b upon x square plus 1 plus cx plus d upon x square plus 4. Here we have written ax plus b because the factors are quadratic. Both the factors are quadratic so we have written ax plus b in the first case and cx plus d in the second case. Okay, now we are going to take the LCM of the right hand side to obtain this expression. The denominator cancels so we are going to get 1 is equal to ax plus b into x square plus 4 plus cx plus d into x square plus 1. Further, if we have to solve this question, what we have to do, we have to apply the coefficient comparison method. We have no other method to solve this question. Okay, so what we have to do, we have to first multiply the term and separate the terms with same power. Okay, so first of all, I take this x square and multiply in this bracket, so I get ax square ax cube plus bx square this 4 multiply in this bracket to give me 4ax plus 4b this x square multiply in this bracket to give me 6 uh, cx cube plus dx square and this 1 multiplies in this bracket to give me cx plus d now we can separate the terms with similar power this ax cube cx cube bx square dx square 4ax and cx and uh, 4b and d okay so we can write this on simplification as 1 is equal to a plus c into x cube plus b plus d into x square plus 4a plus c into x plus 4p plus d so this is my equation number one okay now we are going to solve this equation by coefficient comparison method and we are going to get the following equations on coefficient comparison. The first equation, first of the equation can be a plus c is equal to 0 because here we have a term of x cube whose coefficient is a plus c and here we don't have any term of x cube. So this implies that the, co that the coefficient of x cube that is a plus c should be equal to 0. Okay, again we don't have any term of x in the left hand side but we have the term of x in the right hand side so this means that the coefficient of the term of x should be equal to 0 that is this term should be equal to 0 so for this 4a plus c should be equal to 0 similarly b plus d would again be equal to 0 and 4b plus d would be equal to 1 okay so we mark this as equation number 2 3 4 and 5. Now we have to solve this two equation and these two equations separately to get the values of a and c. Right? Now because a plus c is also equal to 0 and 4 plus c is also equal to 0 so if we are going to subtract these equations so I'm going to get 3a is equal to 0 or a is equal to 0 and when a is equal to 0 so c is equal to 0 so only answer possible for well, these two equations 2 and 3 is that a is equal to 0 c is equal to 0 okay but if we take equation 4 and 5 then if we subtract these two equations I'm going to get 3b is equal to minus 1 this d and this d cancels out or b is equal to 1 by 3 so this means that from this equation equation number 4 I can write d is equal to minus b and since b is equal to 1 by 3 so I get d is equal to minus 1 by 3 now all I have to do I have to place the value of 
A C B and D. In this equation, to obtain the partial fractions, okay, so A and C both are equal to zero. So I'm I'm only interested in the values of B and D. Okay, so I'm going to get one upon x square plus one into x square plus four is equal to one upon three times one upon x square plus one minus one upon three times one upon x square plus four. So the integration, the function which we have to integrate can be written like this. So the integration of this function would be same as integration one by three times the integration of one upon x square plus one dx minus one by three integration of one upon x square plus four dx. Okay. Now here, the formula which is going to help us in solving this integral would be integration of one upon x square plus a square is equal to one upon a ten inverse of x upon a, right? So one can be assumed as one square. So I'm going to get this as one by three times ten inverse of x, and this will be. Minus one by three into one by two ten inverse of x upon two because I can write four as equal to two square, so this will be equal to one by two ten inverse of x upon two. Okay, so further we I have to simplify these two terms to obtain the final answer as equal to one by three ten inverse x minus one by six ten inverse of x upon two plus c, so which is my required answer. friends thanks for watching my video to watch more of these super videos and for the latest update subscribe and like the videos on these channels on youtube hsk shiksha and math help by hsk thank you